of our team coverage. And on your side's Aaron Kelly is live at Norfolk International Airport. And Aaron, looking at the flight board today, it's not looking good coming from or going to the Northeast. Yeah, we're seeing more and more cancellations. When you look at the board and when you look online, there's about uh, 10 cancellations for departures, uh, 10 for arrivals. That's again between what we see online coming up tonight and what's on the board here. We even see a cancellation already for tomorrow. And you're going to have problems if you're traveling to or from places like Newark, New York, Boston, Philadelphia. Um, some of those cities are really having a difficulty with all of this. Uh, we did talk to the airport authority. They're getting ready here just in case for whatever we see here. They're going to have their de icing equipment, their sand trucks ready to. Go. Uh, we did get a chance to talk to one passenger who's traveling from Brazil. He's trying to get to New York, and he said he might not be able to get to New York uh, until Wednesday. It's not nobody's fault. It's fault. Now it's in mother nature, <laughs> so we so, have not, nothing to do. So now you're gonna have to get a hotel. Maybe we. Well, we don't know yet. We just we just for the eight, so we're gonna. <laughs> You're not going to sleep stay. in the airport for two days, are you? Yeah, I don't, I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> And uh, the airline, what's the airport authority is asking you to call the airlines, not the airport. Um, if you are expecting to pick someone up or if you're expecting to fly out, it's best to call the airlines. And the airport authority says you can expect to see more of these cancellations tonight and possibly into tomorrow. For now, that's the latest here in Norfolk. Aaron Kelly, 10 on your side.